Look, my friend. Wish you well. All right, Harold. Where you got the next match? This might be the final match here because they they may play on another table, the, f the fifth and final match on another table. And let's see what we got here. Okay, for Dover Team Dover Asia, we've got Mr. Frank Blackington. Uh, he won the lag. He's going to be breaking. Frank's coming in as a handicap as a five. And his opponent from Bad Thoughts and Bad Shots is Mark Sampson. Mark's coming in as a handicap of six. So it's a race of five to four. Uh, Frank's got a good game. He likes to shoot the eight ball break, second ball. We'll see if he does does what I think he's yeah. say. Yep. Solid hit. Solid hit on the eight. Yep. You see where that eight ball went, Harold? It moved. Yeah. Didn't get rewarded. Well, if you don't hit a solid, you're going to scratch most times. Well, you're going to scratch and they won't break e good either. Yeah. <laughs> well, pretty well spread out here. Might be a good run here. You ever play this guy? Oh, yeah. Yeah? yeah I, I played Frank before, but I haven't played this guy. Yeah, I played, I played Matt. He works with the Rochester school system, a teacher. He's been to my place many years ago. He's a fast rhythm player. Kind of like the kind of player I like. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I like to play that way. Yeah. It'll move it right along. That's what I like. The more you think about it, the worse it is. Yeah, if I sit down there and start thinking about things, I'm thinking about winning the lottery and being on the beach. <laughs> I don't. Uh, then I don't win. I don't make the ball. You better think about something else. <laughs> I don't think you're going to go to the beach. Yeah. Well, I'd like to go to the beach now. Getting a, uh, Snow's on its way. I wasn't even prepared. Got my snowblower all ready this morning and everything, and it won't start. Well, I had a rough time getting home last night. I was I lived on top of the hill, so uh, it was it was just almost a whiteout for a while. He's got... Kind of, oh... Oh, he must have got stitched on that six ball. I think we ended up about two inches on top of the hill. Thank you. One thing, what I, if I'm looking at uh, Frank's cute. He's shooting with a a very thin shaft. Looks like 11, 11 millimeter. Oh. Oh. No, as big as a pencil. <laughs> it's a pencil. <laughs> <laughs> it's a <shooting> pencil. <laughs> well, the shaft, what that's going to do, you have to be real accurate, but it's going to put a lot of spin on the ball. Yeah, you got to be real accurate. I think he's sitting pretty good here. Yeah, looks pretty good. Yeah. Oh, I didn't like that shot. Mm -hmm. A little off the line a little bit. Oh, I thought he should have just put bottom on it. Thank 
shot, nice shot. Yeah. Uh, it's got a tough shot, yeah. A lot of green. <laughs> He's putting a, lo a lot of inside on it. And that's what, that's why he missed that. He was trying to keep the cue ball on the left, on that same side as the pocket for the eight in the opposite corner. I, 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 I like this shot. It's yeah, I like it because it was on Mac coming over for the 13. Yeah, and if he missed, like he did, he'd leave a little difficult shot. I do think he shot that one just a, a little bit too quick. It's okay. That's not good. it was yeah Frank's not happy with himself he knows but took full advantage of, advantage of that one yeah yeah nice shooting well now it's a race to four each when I shot the six I got and missing right into he's like oh good lead miss it I'll tell you what that's going to do. If Frank don't put that behind him, Harold, then, then Mark, this is what he feeds off of. Oh, yeah. We'll see after this game, though. Yeah. Uh, see how he rebounds. And the thing is, he, he shot good, too. He did up until then? Yeah. Eh, you know, first game, heck, that happens. That just shows you you got to focus even on the easiest shots. Can't miss again. Six, though, you know. Can't give him a chance. Too many shots. Wow. Well, he's gonna take low. He's gonna take low balls, unless he decides to take that set. Uh, was that in the side pocket? The fourteen. The fourteen. Yeah, the green. Yeah, fourteen. Yeah, I try the combination. I don't care how 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 they look. A combination is hard. Mm -hmm. I don't care what you say. I I, I don't even know why I sh shot the combination. I I thought no. the one I thought the one could have gone in there uh, by itself. But I, I don't know. Maybe the angle. I didn't. Maybe it couldn't get there by itself. Would have been just as well to take the fourteen to it inside. Yep. <clears throat> That's a nice shot. He's going to come across for the two ball. Okay. This is a speed shot, Harold. He's going to put a lot of right spin on it. A bit of inside. Come up for the four ball. Too hard. Uh oh, no. A little bit too hard. Maybe not enough spin. 
Well, he hit it way too hard because you wanted the four ball in the opposite corner. You know what I mean? That was a speed shot. <coughs> in and out. And it was both. It was too hard and not enough inside and spin. You're right. I think so, yeah. Yeah. Shot though at 14. One for the 13. Nice shot. That was a tough shot. Mm -hmm. Makes it look easy. Now what? He's in no man's land right here. 10 can't go, 15, 13. Combinations. Yeah, that was extremely tough. Yeah. It was actually pretty close. <clears throat> okay, Frank's going to go ahead and pop in the three ball down here. He's either going to have to follow it with a little bit of speed or put bottom on it. Not enough bottom. Not hot enough. Mm -hmm. no, he, he, he's in a... He's, he's got to cut this, I think. What do you think? Six ball. He's got to cut it. I'd, I'd, I'd put it back on this uh, this bank here. Shave, shave the stick and six and come back on the bank. Play it safe. What do you think? I don't know. I think a safe's really hard to get on this. All those balls are open. Leave the cue right in the middle of the uh, bank. Might have been a lot easier than taking that long shot. No, I think he should have cut. I, I think he should have sliced in the six. Because of the angle. Yeah. I got perfect for the eight after. Ooh, I thought I'd follow it. Think that was an error? Absolutely. I I, I I think he shot that last ball on fourteen oh. totally wrong. Yeah, all he had to do was follow it a little bit. Yeah. Well sometimes come off the back. Yeah, but you know, sometimes when you're just trying to stroke the ball, which he is, you feel good. Yes. games Frank gave him. Uh, Two games and nothing. Yeah, Frank had a, try, had a chance to win in both games. Talked about to see what happens in the second game. Yeah. And I think that made a difference. That first game makes a difference. Scratch on a break, open table. Yeah, well, what's the rule here, Harold, after you scratch on the open and break? Well, you got to come behind the head spring over here. Uh, 
You got your choice, but come back right where it is. Can't go over the line. Okay. That's only after the break. <clears throat> Is that why I always have that shot when I'm playing you? I'm always shooting behind the... Well, I tell you different when you're playing me. <laughs> you know, seems like you're always scratching with me, so I'm always put, getting uh, yeah, in well, the kitchen. Oh, man. One of these days. Now you'll learn. Can't believe what everybody says. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how they try to make that one. He's going, to be, he's going to be tough to be. He looks like he wants to shoot down. <clears throat> he's going to try to break up this uh, 12 ball. Oh. Yeah, he he hit the ball too much and he didn't have enough spin on it because he was what they were trying. I think what I think what he was trying to do is use a lot of inside and come down and break out that 12 ball. that seven. I kind of like this. Try to break them up and he just missed. Shooting there. Yeah. Oh. Good shot. Yeah. See, 
that's what I'm saying, uh, Mark, is because of the, the games that was given to him, he's feeding off of that. Oh, yeah, yeah. But I guarantee you, if, if uh, Frank wins this game and the next game, the game's, Mark's game's going to change. He's, he's going to be missing a few more balls. Hopefully not. I don't know. He's in tough. He's in tough right now. Yeah, the, the other guy's shooting good now. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's what I say. Yeah. Frank has to win this game. I think it's a do or die shot. I mean, it's the game. See, it does just the opposite for the guy when he's you're in a position such as Frank, because your confidence is down, and then you end up shooting easy shots. I mean, you're just tapping them, so you're out of your game plan. Well, I know how he's feeling now. He can make anything right now, the way he's shooting. Frank is tough there. Is the 12 ball screwed up? Yeah, I think you got a. Uh, yeah, what, what, he, what he was trying to do, Harold, I think he was trying to cut the 13 and come down with top and run into those uh, that cluster right yeah, there. Yeah, that's what I thought too, yeah. The 9, 11, and 6. Well, he miscued because that's a friggin' 9 millimeter shaft. <laughs> Friggin' James's uh, Q shaft over there. It's friggin' nine to ten millimeters. It's easy to miss Q too. That's a little bit too small, I think. I don't know. I couldn't get used to that. It's not that small. Yeah, it's a snooker. It's a snooker shaft. Okay, well, he, he has the same shot, except on the opposite side now. Same breakout. Oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all he could do. That's all Mark could do. Yeah, he was... He wasn't going to leave nothing anyway. Well, that's three and twelve. There are trouble, trouble yep. some balls. Yeah. Shot the regular up with that nine there. Nine on the side. Yep, he needs to come down. Slow down. Yeah. Slow down. You want an angle on that. He's, he, he came down too much for the breakout. Uh, he's going to have to put a lot of right on it. A little right. Unless he's too straight. <clears throat> I think I would play a safety right here off the 13. He had the right idea. I think it was a little bit too straight on that. On that, to get good action out of it. See now, now you can't even see it. Actually, I'm going to make a. 
Yeah, well, I think it's all over. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think it's all over. Should be able to break him up. <laughs> he, one he, one he, ball in the corner? Well, he, he could actually just run two or three balls and let Frank right back at the same table. Well, he didn't have to break him up. He can make that eight in the corner. Yeah, it kind of looks like. Oh, oh boy. Oh, there you go, Frank. Well, you can give him a chance. Yeah. Yeah, well, he, he, ha he has to hit top. Maybe a little bit of right spin on it with a little bit of speed. He's got to go up and down the table. Couldn't play it in the corner? No, it goes in the side. Look at this. Look at this. on the hill. This is the guy over there could tell him what to do with that stick. It seems like everybody's breaking good. I like taking the 13, coming down for the 14. She hit a little bit harder. Hmm. No, the, th the, thir the 13 was the shot, and then you have the 14 there. The reason why, what I think the reason why Frank didn't shoot that is because his confidence is down. Because the, the side pocket was an easier shot. So he's in a tough position. You get, mentally, you got to get out of it. Hmm. Yeah, he's, he's, uh, yeah. he's not getting the rolls, nothing, now. No. Well, that's, that's what I'm saying from the beginning is his, his, his opponent's feeding off that, doing just the opposite. And with no confidence, you're shooting way too easy. He got all out of the line on that one. Yeah. yeah. Well, because he shot the wrong ball. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You gotta, Max is going to take that all the way down in the opposite corner, that three ball. I think he's going to take the three ball. Yeah. 
I would have cut it right in. I wouldn't have played it off the ball, though. Shooting too fast now. He wants to get it over with. think I'd bang it. I, I think I would just try to tap into it a little bit. Keep the cue ball on the right side of the corner of the pocket. Nice and easy. Just like that. He hit it a little bit too too full. But that's the shot I was thinking of. Yeah, really no way to hide him though. Yeah, well the, 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 you weren't going to hide him. You got to make it difficult. Leave him a long shot on the 13 or the 9. Okay, let's go, Frank. I think Frank, I, I'm going to make a prediction. Like I said, I'm not good at predictions. Uh oh. You're kidding me. You can make it. Oh, you can yeah, make it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I get, he's just not getting the rules. Yeah, but I think he could have cut that, though. That was a good shot, though. Yeah, I think Frank should have took that nine ball earlier. Are you kidding? <laughs> wow. That would have been that would have been the end of everything. Yeah, he's he's in a funny shot here. What do you do here, Harold? He's almost straight in. Do you stroke it and just fi force can't follow? You can't stop it. Force follow? Evidently. Nope. Yep. Uh, he's, he's just giving up now. <laughs> yeah. Have no shot. <laughs> Only one shot to spin it in. Spin it in the corner. I think you should play a safety here. 
I like uh, clipping it to the thin, to the left side, coming t uh, two, two to three rails down the cue ball. Ten to ten with that. Right. <laughs> well, what, what I was saying is like a straight pull shot, you know, you skim yeah. off the left-hand side, come off with two rails, three rails, and leave, uh, leave it down near the corner pocket, and he'd have to bank the three somewhere. He's just going to take that down in the corner pocket, stop shot it, eight in the side pocket, and we're going to have a winner here. When they're running for you, you know, no matter what you do, yeah, it don't yep, seem to yep, work out. Yep, yep, yep. Just wasn't uh, Frank's day because, Frank, you know, Frank's a good shooter. That, that first game was the key. Yeah. That was the key to the game. Oh, yeah, perfect. Right behind the he lost a little bit, uh, you know, out of that first game. It was a big win for uh, Team Bad Thoughts. Okay, congratulations, Mark. Mark Sampson uh, takes it five nothing, five games to nothing. Had a boy and uh, bad thoughts and bad shots uh, got their first win.